underrated procreate functions that you might not know about. First, if you're not sure which color goes well with what, you can click harmony and then there's this like cool wheel that you can play around with. And if you click this little corner thing here, it gives you like different options. Like there's complementary colors. Next, also color related, I love playing around with the hue, color balance, and curves. It's quite sensitive, however, so like slight change can make your painting look like a really different color. But most of the time, they turn out looking quite nice. Next, Procreate has a really cool function that allows you to import stamps. If you want to practice rendering or coloring, or if you just want to save time doing backgrounds and stuff, that's from here, here, and here. Next, if you're using references, make sure you turn on this little box. So wherever you are on your canvas, you can have this little box and like move it around. Next, if you go into help, you can download a 3D model pack. Honestly, it's not a lot. It's just these nine. But yeah, I think it's a new function, so it's kind of fun to play around. Maybe they'll come out with more later on. I don't know. Also, this video is not sponsored by Procreate, but hi, Procreate, please notice me. And lastly, they have this cool glitch option. You can kind of play around with the intensity of it. I think it would look super cool with some styles of art.